Hey, Dana here, and welcome to Searching for Behind the Scenes. What I'm doing right now is making my transducer pole longer. Let's record a PVC. Gotta get this done. Yeah. Okay, so here's here's Mr. Union. Here's the adapter. I figured I wanted to make sure it was at least a foot foot below the boat. I think I'd be able to get a better uh, instead of right right at the bottom of the boat. And now that I can control it and get it in and out of the water, I don't have that. Pro I don't have to worry about grounding out. Also, I know there's nothing interfering with the transducer to do what I need it to do. And it's under the water enough that you don't have what they call noise, or too much noise. Okay. I soften up the soften up the PVC by putting that clear on there. And then I can put my final piece through here. Give it a little yeah, for a couple of seconds. I think I used cleaner on this one here, and it was enough to stick it <laughs> to it. Or I can go ahead and put another union on here. The union them together. Got it long enough. There we go. Right on the tree. Alright. Alright. Okay. Let's see that. Okay, and I got I got it, so I got it. back out far as we go right. okay so got this like that so now I can take it all the way out as far as I can get it and now it is it's out of the it is out of the water and 
see. It's about two feet up, which is good. Still need a handle. And then, I'm gonna put it down in the water. It's gonna be. Right now, it's completely out of the water. There's no way it can hit anything. Okay, right now, it's like the bottom. The, bo uh, the bottom of the boat, uh, water comes to about here on the line here. So it's in the water right here. So I guess I can mark. Uh, I don't know if I got my. Got a marker right here someplace. Let's see if I can get this piece off of here so I can. So I've got a handle. <laughs> stepped on that well, I could not get this I couldn't get this piece out all I put on it was cleaner so I've got another I've got another union so I guess I'm using I guess I'm doing the union connection on it I could save the union I just chop that out Take the saws off and break it off. Break it out of there. That's an idea. Saws on. Chop it out. I can put on the rest of it. Wasted it. Hole out. I guess I can do like that. Can't lose the tight. Can't lose the. Let's see when you are. Let's see which way is that facing? This one. This is gonna be facing backwards. Hmm. I don't want it so I can take the pole out whenever I want to. If I need to. Then again. Because even if it drops out, you're on cable, so you're not going to lose any. All you want is to be able to turn that. But again, I just used cleaner on it when I put it in. That was it. Down the water, I'm gonna go well, like so. Now it's out of the water. Can't believe the cleaner held it that tight. That's that. I'm gonna drop it down. Not like that. Not like that. I know where my my handle is, or where the which way the transducer is facing. We need need the transducer facing back. Could put could put little screws through here. Just the little holes. And if I need to get the top off of it, now I can get get the top off of it. Go ahead and use that. Oh, there's all kinds of ways to do it. I wonder if the wobbling back and forth is going to screw up the transmission. This is not got a solid. Hmm. Didn't think about that. Maybe, I don't know. Gonna have to try it and see.
I'm wondering, if, you know, it being so, so short. I may have to put something in here to keep that from getting solid. Probably need it as solid as possible. The transducer's not going back and forth, back and forth. Not getting a good reading. It's going to be steady, but I don't know. I haven't thought about it. All right, so that's where we're at with that. Just enough. I didn't even put anything on it. Stick it together. Let's face it backwards. And just enough. Just enough to glue on there and get it. So it's square. More than, all right, more than enough. So you're straight back, straight back, and I know right where the, right where the transducer is facing. All right. All right, here we go. Well, that's the modification of the transducer pole. Thanks for watching. If you like, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. We'll catch you on the next Searching for Behind the Scenes.